Hi everyone, my name is Flex from Digital Pottery. It's been a long time since I did the last tutorial. I was being busy so I couldn't make a tutorial. Even today I couldn't uh, do a longer version. But I will give you some amazing tips how I create this uh, Lego generator. One of them is how I extended the switch node. And the rest download a free file from my Gumroad page and learn a lot from it. Support, like, subscribe and thank you so much for your amazing support. It means a lot for me and keeps me drive. Stay tuned. So as you can see on the geometry nodes, it's a very complex nodes, so it will take a lot of time, but uh, now I will show you this uh, amazing node, uh, how I extended the switch node and uh, how it gives me a way to change between multiple objects or values. First of all, the default switch node. Uh, is uh, limited to only two inputs that's uh, you can only uh, switch between two objects or values so that's a limitation but it doesn't mean it's not powerful so when you dive in the geo node side did you get uh, this uh, on these nodes so let me show you with a new one from utility menu let's add the switch node and again from utility menu let's add mass node and change it to uh, greater than so we need the greater value so let's link the greater than output to the switch and let's uh, uh, group them Control G and uh, let's uh, for the inputs a new input change it to integer because we need an integer value the switch is an integer value so let's uh, link it to the threshold of the greater than value and uh, let's change the first value to one or the false value uh, take it to the input and change the false to geo one yeah like that and we get the first switch to add the second switch duplicate the switch node and link it to the first switch node and change the uh, false value to true and again duplicate and link the greater than value to switch the threshold link it to the input that we did and the value at this time we need to change it to 2 so when we go up with the integer value it will change the objects based on these values and take the false value to uh, geo input and change the name to geo to if you want to extend more duplicate and link and output to output the threshold to input but this time this is the value one this one is two and we need to change it to three so you can add hundred so there's no limitation in this node so this is a node that we created let's uh, replace it with this one to geo one geo two geo three switch input now it works so let me show you with a simple example let's copy this one paste it around here and uh, link the switch to the hairstyle let's add uh, some meshes you can switch between multiple objects and you can add more and more and more it's so powerful so i hope you can use it for more complex geonodes so this is it for now thank you so much for tuning uh next time i'll bring more amazing assets and techniques so don't forget to subscribe like support and share and thank you so much for your support bye